there are some certain ways that your body tells you that your ovaries are releasing egg so in this video i'll be telling you on the signs and symptoms of ovulation the first one is calculation method calculation method it is when you know your cycle length and how will you know your cycle length it is when you take notes when you start counting from the first day that you see your period blood till the last day before your next period it is the number of days in between your period so if your cycle length is 28 cycle length then you have to subtract 14 from the cycle length it will be remaining 14 so you are likely to ovulate on the 14 days and if your cycle length is 30 you have to subtract 14 from it it will be remaining 16 that means you have to ovulate on the 16th day the next one is resting temperature if you want to conceive you have to do resting temperature to know if you are ovulating how to do this resting temperature it is when you wake up first thing in the morning then you check your body temperature if your body temperature is it increases to 0 0.5 degrees celsius or 1 degree celsius that means you are all ovulating or you have you are likely to ovulate but when it increases more than one degree celsius that means you are having fever that one is no longer ovulation you have to go to your doctor for for medication that will bring down your fever when your vagina discharge is more plentier transparent and stretcher what i mean by stretcher is when you hold it on your hand and you are stretched it, it can be able to stretch that means it can be more stretcher then you know that you are ovulating when you have tenderness of the breast so you can know that you're ovulating but some people they do not experience tenderness of the breast before they can know that they are ovulating so body differs some people will experience tenderness of the breast while some does not experience it some also experience lower abdominal cramps they feel crowns on their lower abdomen to show that they are ovulating it is not also applicable in all women to know that they are ovulating some doesn't feel that pain why some feel that pain hi everyone if you are new to this channel kindly do where to press your subscription button and press your notification bell so that you don't miss contents like this whenever i upload and if you're a returning subscriber you are highly welcome what causes this sign it is due to a hormone that is in the female body which is estrogen and the progesterone estrogen and progesterone that the one that causes you to experience to notice the symptoms of ovulation when you are ovulating so during the first half of your menstrual cycle your ovaries will release estrogen once there's increased level of estrogen it will make the biggest follicle to rupture and then releases an egg and the egg that it releases it will go to the fallopian tube then waiting for the sperm to come and fertilize it the collaboration of estrogen and progesterone are what gives us the symptoms of ovulations like increased temperature feeling bloatedness some women they feel food they feel heavy in their stomach when they're ovulating and changes in your vaginal discharge some other ways is when you buy ovulation test strip ultrasound can also help you to detect if you are ovulating so thank you for watching this video kindly like share subscribe to this channel and turn on your notification bell see you in our next video bye